Okay, so for the letter N, what you want to do is go one, two, three, one, two, three on either side, on the left and right sides. Stairs pointing towards each other like so. Then in the center, you want to do a right way around stair following this trail and an upside down stair underneath it following the upper trail like so. And there we have our N. Okay, so for O, what you want to do is go four and four with pillars on the left and right. Replace the top ones with stairs facing outwards and underneath as well, like so. So we have these sort of shapes and then we place a slab on the bottom, a slab on the top, and there we have our letter O. Okay, so for the letter P, what you want to do is go one, two, three, four, then a block, then a stair, and then an upside down stair underneath that stair. Then remove the block, place in a slab on the upper part of the block, and a slab on the lower part of the other stair. So we have this one block in the center, and that's how we make our letter P. the letter Q what you want to do is start off with a four high pillar of quartz on the left hand side then an upside down stair and a right way around stair on top then a four block high again on the right hand side right way around stair on top and right way around stair on the bottom as well like so then an upside down stair in the center and a slab on the upper half of the stair on top and there we have our letter Q So for the letter R, what you want to start off with is a one, two, three, four high pillar on the left hand side. Then you want to do a block, a right around stair, then an upside down stair on top of that, and a right around stair on top of that, a slab on top, and then a slab on the second block down on the bottom half of the block, and there we have our letter R. Okay, so for the letter S, what you want to start off with is a block in the center, stairs either side, a slab in the center, then a stair, then a slab on the upper half of the block, then a block, then a slab on top of that, then turn it into a block to make it easier to place in the upside down stair, and replace it again with a slab, then do a right around stair, another block and then a stair and then replace the block with a slab on the upper half of the block and there we have our letter S. Okay so for the letter T it's a very simple structure it's just one two three four blocks up in the center then a slab on the upper half of the block on the top block on the left and then the same on the right to make our very simple letter T. So for the letter U, what you want to do is place a block in the center, and we won't be removing that block, so you don't have to worry about that. Then upside down stair on the left and right. Then one, two, three on the left, and one, two, three on the right to make our letter U. Okay, so for the letter V, what you want to do is place in a block in the center, a block on top, an upside down stair on the left and the right of the block, two blocks on top of those stairs and then remove this center block and replace it with just a quartz slab to make our letter V. Okay so for the letter W it is a five block wide letter instead of a three block wide letter this is similar to the M if you haven't seen that already you can go back and watch it in the previous episode but for this you want to go one two three four up one, two, three, four up on both sides like so, with a three block gap in the center. Then stairs facing each other on the left and right pillars. Upside down stairs beneath them facing outwards. Then an upside down stair facing inwards with a right way around stair on top of that facing towards the pillar. We mirror it on the opposite side and then we place two blocks lined up with the stair in the center to make our letter W.
Okay, so for our letter X, what we're going to start off with is just by making two pillars on the five blocks either side, like so. This is just to support us, so we want to then do an upside down stair, mirror it, then a right way around stair on the top, mirror it, then an upside down stair underneath the top block, top the uh, top stair, mirror it, right way around stair on the bottom stair, like so. And then two slabs in the center, remove your supporting pillars, and there we have our letter X. Okay, so for the letter Y, what you want to do is go one, two, three blocks in the center, stairs, upside down either side of the top block, then stairs on top of them, facing towards each other, remove the top block and replace it with a quartz slab. And there we have our letter Y. Okay, so for the letter Z, what you want to do is go two blocks across with slabs, then a block on the end on the right hand side, then a stair, an upside down stair, a right around stair, and then an upside down stair with a block on top of that, and then two slabs on the upper half of the block going across to make our letter Z.